Hey, this summer camp, Silver Moon at Camp Crossley in North Webster is giving kids with sickle cell disease a fun-filled summer camp experience. Joining me, you heard of us all, on the red couch this morning is Jordan Ronnie in the middle. A sixth grader at Crestview Elementary is Ann Kelly, far side, and Dr. Anjali Rampersad. Did I get that close? You did. Fantastic. Good morning. And in case people are wondering what we are talking about, she goes, where's, where's Lindy? <laughs> <laughs> I will try to do my best. Uh, first, doctor, explain a little bit about sickle cell anemia. Uh, what is it and who does it predominantly affect? Absolutely. So sickle cell anemia is caused by an abnormal hemoglobin, which is a liquid inside of our red blood cells. Um, we do see it very often in persons of African-American background, Hispanics or Middle Easterns. Mm -hmm. And unfortunately, this abnormal hemoglobin causes your red cells to go from a normal um, round and very squishy shape that passes easily through blood vessels into these very stiff and um, sticky C-shaped kind of cells. And currently there's treatment, but there is not a cure? There's treatment and cure is coming. We have patients who are cured by transplant already okay. at Riley Children's, and we are awaiting uh, approval for gene therapy to cure sickle cell disease. Now, the problem with these um, abnormal cells when they form is that they actually block blood flow in your body. So children with sickle cell disease, when they have these episodes, can have very severe pain and deep in their bones that can last for days. And we have to be really careful to avoid the triggers for these episodes. Okay, before we talk about the camp, I want to talk to you, uh, Jordan. Tell us a little bit what, what it's like dealing with this. You're very smiley. You have a great attitude. Thank What's you. it like? Uh, it hurts, but at the same time, it's not that bad when you get used to it. And then they have medicines to help you, and you got a lot of good doctors. Kelly, you look at him like, what? It's right. not that bad. <laughs> it's not, because I got medicine to take care of it. At times. Yeah. At times, but it yeah. can change. Okay. Uh, tell us a little bit about the camp. So Camp Silver Moon was formed in 2017, and we hold it at the YMCA Camp Crosley location. It's on the edge of beautiful Lake Tippecanoe in North Webster, Indiana. The kids have so much fun. There are just so many activities available to them. And the Camp Crosley um, team has worked with us to tailor a very special program for kids with sickle cell disease who, because of their um, you know, hemoglobin abnormality, might not have the stamina to do a full day of regular camp or might have um, episodes of these pain, um, pain crises if they are not hydrating well during camp or if they get too chilly. What do you have as a favorite? Do you have a favorite thing to do at the camp? Uh, going swimming at the big lake. <laughs> big swimmer? Yeah. I was a terrible swimmer. <laughs> Absolutely <laughs> awful. So congrats for you. Uh, tell us a little bit about how the camp can accommodate uh, those who have sickle cell different ways. So one of the important things is because of their anemia, this is lifelong. They actually don't have much stamina for the full day of camp activities. So we have that tailored with Camp Crosley. Um, we also make sure that they have their water bottles full and they're hydrating well throughout the day because dehydration is actually one of the triggers that causes your blood cells to switch into that abnormal normal shape, which then blocks blood flow through your body and can cause pain. Um, the other thing that we work on is making sure that they're dressed in layers for those chilly mornings at camp and um, they don't get too cold. You can also have trouble if you've gone swimming and you don't dry off well enough because when you get cold, this is when you have these episodes oh. of pain too. Yeah, that doesn't so we have to have these special precautions for our kids, but they get the best out of it because of that. What are you guys talking about over there? <laughs> You're He's doing your own pictures. interview. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just curious. Uh, what do you want other kids to know about the camp and sickle cell itself? Uh, that the camp is actually very fun and it's very special for people with sickle cell. And it's not like regular camps. And to tell other people with sickle cell, I really don't got nothing to say. <laughs> Uh, you can say. say come long, join us. Come as long join as us. it's clean, you can say. <laughs> I, I, I can't think of nothing. That's okay. All right. Uh, the aunt, Kelly, you were yes. the one that was not supposed to not say anything. Right. Remember? Very little. Very that little. was the agreement <laughs> going into this. All right. We have more information on this. You can go to fox59.com. All right. For right now, let's.